today I'm going to work on this a Donkey Kong cocktail. Um, I don't know if I did a video on it, but I did cap this. I might have just updated during a different video. Let me see if I can turn it on. I don't have any of my five tripods with me, so what I do film is going to be free-handed. If I can find the power button, there we go. No, oh, hang on, sorry. Which way does it flip? Jeez. There we go. So we get a startup sound. But other than that, there's no game function. At least there wasn't. Let's see. I did cap it. Okay, it's starting to come on. And no game image from what I can see. So I did check power supply. The power supply is putting out the proper voltage. So I'm going to open this sucker up and dig in. Stick around. I'm Walter Day, the father of esports, and you're watching Maddie Mo's Arcade. And you know how long it's been? I've been stuck playing black and gold. I'm getting ready to attack. Fanny pack attached. Tokens are all stacked. Got the mallet in my grasp. Waiting for the moles. Ha! Hiding in their holes. Score we're keeping tally. I'll be playing till they close now. Can't nobody beat my high score. You can't beat my high score. Can't nobody beat my high score. You can't beat my high score. I'm a mallet master. A single fisted blaster. You can ask my baby. Dark soul then gets faster. I'm a record set or my This is the inside. Don't get fooled by the monitor if you can see it. There is Donkey Kong Burn. That is not a game image. Um, we have the I think it was horizontal hold pot was broken off. It's a 200 200k thousand or 200 k is 200,000 ohm uh, potentiometer. I didn't have any. This one was close. so put it in for now until the other ones come. Um, it should be fine. It should work fine, but I do have the proper ones coming. Just didn't realize they were coming from China. So our voltages are good coming out of here. I don't know if you can hear that. We got that kind of siren sound that we had on the last Donkey Kong, which there was a transistor on Clove that they recommended to change. It did not help my situation that time. But it did help lots of people, so maybe it'll help this time. But if we get game sounds going, we probably won't notice that so much. Because I think a lot of people have that and don't realize it. So, basically, we have power coming out here. We have some power getting to the board, but we have no video going from the board to the monitor. So, that's the first thing I'm going to check, which is this cable. So, uh, I guess I'm going to have to pull this monitor out of here. <laughs> so, we're not getting any video off the board. I ran a different uh, video cable because the other one, yeah, I couldn't test it because the pins had so much, so much oxidation on them. So I'm going to pull this board and give it a look. i um, really kind of surprised it's putting out no video. I figured at least I'd get garbage and it won't start a game up. So uh, I have to figure something out. Somewhere where the power is coming in, it's not getting it. So I will pull the board and we'll take a look. Alright, before I even start, look at all the dust that's in here. I guess it's dust. <laughs> that's gross. Look at these chips. Let me see if I can focus in. Look at the dust. Where's my brush? There it is. Alright. Um, yeah. I don't know if that hurts it any, but uh, I imagine it's not helping any. Jeez, look at that. So I'm gonna just go through this and clean it. Um, that we might find some real issues on this one. That's pretty gross. All right, well, give me a few minutes to clean this, and then uh, we'll check some of these sockets and some of these chips here. I did not expect that. All right, be right back. All 
right, so I got all the dust cleaned off of this, and uh, this bottom board here was just full of uh, cold solder joints. And not even just cold solder joints, but like holes where there was no solder. The other ones weren't as bad, but I did go through real fast and just reflow all that stuff. So I'm going to throw it back in. I got the monitor put to get back together, hiding over there. Gonna put it back together, see if we get a signal. If not, then I'm gonna start hitting these test points and check it. And then we're gonna have to bust out the uh, logic probe if we don't get any farther than that. See what's really going on. All right, let's see. Oh, still nothing on the screen. So no video, so it actually has a problem. It's not just cleaning, not just cold solder joints. So pull the board back out and uh, we're going to have to really start digging into it this time. I was hoping it was going to be easy. It did look like it was missing a ROM, and there were a couple that looked iffy. But we should get something to come on the screen. Um, I don't know if it's the uh, processors or what's going on. So I'll do a little research, and I just wanted to make sure it wasn't something going on with the monitor, and I just wasn't getting a picture. All right, well... I will take this home and we'll work on it more tonight. Thanks. So these two right here are going to be ground in 5 volt. So what do we get here? Did I not turn the game on? I didn't turn the game on. I guess that would help. Hang on. Here it is. A nice little trade. The person I traded got what they wanted. I got what I wanted, and a pretty good deal on it too. Super and if hang I didn't get what I want. <laughs> <laughs> that comes later. Yeah. Okay. It's it's, it's on fire. What happened? Whoa. Lots of smoke. Well, that's bad. Yeah. Well, thanks for watching. <laughs> when you take care of people, people take care of you in this community. That's the truth. So everyone. Please remember that, even if we're competitors, we're not enemies.